Hey, it's Blake's Nature Live. I'm here with my baby Marjorie. You see this other little baby right here? This is a big old sour sop, almost four pounds. Ooh. We're about to cut it open. We're going to start off at this end. It's kind of squishy, really ripe. You hear that down below? That's our dog playing with the squeak toy. All right. Let's cut into it. I want to just get this old part off first. There you go. Well, this is going to be really good. Look at that. I'm going to put this one to the side for the moment. Show it in there. We went to the market. Which market was that? Because we're in the... Uh, Redlands Flea Market. I'm going to go ahead and just cut all the way down. So this is probably the biggest one I ever bought. Okay. It smells really good. Yes, yeah, it's, it's going to be a really good one. It's got a lot of... Wow, that's a beautiful one. Look at that. There you go. I'm going to keep all these seeds and grow them out and graft them. So let's set this one over here and we can save that one. Is that in the way? No, you're fine. It's right there. It's perfect. Okay. You have to see it. All right. So we have a few fruits we'll try. We'll have us a mame that was ready, a little squishy. And then when I was walking, we're not going to have this right now. This is Aki. It fell from someone's tree. I was walking on uh, down the road, on the sidewalk, and I'll take these seeds out and just cook the the pulp. And that's edible. The seeds are not. They're, they're toxin. They can hurt you. So don't be eating these seeds. All right, so let's uh, cut into it. Cut you a little piece. And you try it first. Let me get this middle part out. You don't eat that? Mm -mm. This is that, uh, you could, but I've never done it. I don't think it would be edible. All the known have this. I'll be flinging on you. <laughs> All right. Try this, baby. And we'll put the seeds. We can put the seeds right in here. This is kind of squishy, but I'll try to eat it later. That's good. That's the good stuff. Mm -hmm. Mm. Mm. That is really good. Oh my god. Oh my god, that's sweet. delicious. There's not a lot of sour to it. I wonder if this is the Miami sour or something. I mean, it's a little slightly berry. There's a little bit of sour. Tartness. I mean, tartness of it. More, more sweet. I like the. It's um, uh, it's at its perfect ripeness. That's the end the here is really ripe. <laughs> Thing got squished. See how squishy it is. But well, we'll see what we could do with that. Probably mm. dropped me the ball. Look at that. Nice. Went right, right into the napkin. So there's a lot of health benefits to sour sop when I went up. I mean, you can just have all kind of vitamins. Very, has a lot of fights cancer, cancer fighting properties. Oh, there's some concentrations of it that helps with cancer. You can tea the leaves. Just don't eat the seeds. Just spit them out and grow them. I want more. Yeah, I'll get you some more. Texture. Very custardy. Just Stringy. Got little pockets, you know. Stringy or fibrous. Here, in this one. See how juicy it is? This thing was, this was heavy. If I would have dropped it, it would just blow up. I have a... I kind of like sucking the seeds out of it. I do too. So there are literally little pulps with the seed in it that you push out. Kind of like sugar apple and uh, cherry moya. After moya. Oh, I'm going to be like, we're almost done, but we have another piece. Another piece for another day. 
We'll my enjoy parents these. gotta try it. Oh my god, it's so good. We a little bit I haven't more. had a good one like this since we went to Nicaragua two years mm -hmm. ago. It was so good. Because it grew out differently with long leaves. So good. It was mm -hmm. so sweet. And it was long. It was long I wish we would have got a picture of it. I don't know why I didn't. I think we were sick. <laughs> we weren't really We were really good. sick. I wasn't used to the food of uh, the cheese. Oh, but all these seeds you can grow back out, make other plants, you can graft them, or use the leaves for tea. Has all antioxidants in it. Mm. I just hit sour. Sour bit. Mm hmm. Mm. I did. That's good it's though. Sour. Oh man. That's good. It's like sour, like it's a tolerable sour. It's like a like a sour gummy worm sour. It's like sweet sour. Yeah. Let's put this over here for right now. Let's have some let's check this mom may here while to the hands. Wanna try some? Yeah, I want some. Mm -hmm. You gonna come out on the video. Come to the video? It's almost as good as the Nicaragua. Is yeah, it good? Mm -hmm. Yes. There you go. Yeah, you want some? Thank you. Also, just save the seeds and I'll Mom plant said, them. Mom said a little piece. Okay. Ad Addison, you want some? Hubieran hecho con emoción así ustedes que Mira, ¿qué está saliendo en el video? Just keep the, keep the seeds and I'll grow them out. Keep all the seeds. Oh, no, it's still it. recording. It is. Mira, ahí está la luz roja. You're famous now. And for that, we're going to put it in the bloopers. <laughs> Alright, so let's take this here. <clears throat> Alright. And there's Apollo. No, it's Onyx. Oh. <laughs> Never mind, I was wrong this time. All right, Mame, it's in the Sope family. It kind of reminds me of sweet potato. It's super sweet with this other nice uh, flavor that mixes with it together. Let's finish cutting it. And sometimes, if you, yeah, most of the time, they'll, the seed will be already sprouting for you. Let's see if this one is. Well, this one's really <gasps> nice. Yummy. Look at that. Here, here, here. This is a little small one. But look at that. Look how red it is. Now they stay they stay on a tree for two years. So when you're picking them, or if you're getting them from the store, dig into the skin a little bit. If it's not orange, do not buy it because it's not going to turn darker orange. If it's orange, buy that one. But it's going to be dark. The skin has to be like squishy. Yes. I don't know if you guys could see, but. You want it to kind of you see how the the skin kind of wrinkles. Yeah, you want it to wrinkle. No, it gets picked big. early. Sometimes they don't ripen fully, and you'll have one side really ripe. Yeah. So this seed has not sprouted yet, but we'll plant it. Let's put let's put it in our seed section. All right, let Marjorie try the fruit first. How's this one? Very soft. Very soft. You guys want mame? Mmm. Very soft. It's very, um, a lot of flavors. Look like bottle. a sweet potato with a, some other hint of flavor that goes with it. A little bit of cinnamon. I almost got cinnamon and, and some spice in it. It's Excuse like me. a warm fruit. Let's get rid of one. Let me get you a firmer one. That's a little soft. Here we go. Want some mommy? It don't matter. Somebody's camera shot. <laughs> it's good, right? Here you the go. sour salt. You yeah, um, just keep the seeds. I'll I'll sow them. You want some mame? Are you 
It's good. Really good. The consistency is very, very soft. I've had some that are stringy also. Right. Yeah, I'll take care of it. Just put the plate right here. I'll... Here you go. Here, I'll, I'll take the... Yeah, right there. You can dump it right there. There you go. Thank you. Thank you. My elbow went into the mame. <laughs> mm. And then another day we'll try to do, we got some cacao. <gasps> yes. I don't know if we, we want to do it today. It seems like it's pretty close ready. Would you want to try something like that today or tomorrow? No, I think this is a lot of sweetness. Yeah, we'll today. do that tomorrow. And then we have some sugar apples for another day. Then we're going to have a little bit more. And then we're going to stop and check the, check on the, eat on some more fruit tomorrow. Look at that. So beautiful. Mmm. A lot of vitamin A. A lot of fruits and vegetables that have really dark orange have a lot of vitamin A in it. Mm-hmm. Delicious. Really, really good. Really good. I think from today's video, if you guys haven't seen our other fruit tasting video, we'll try to link it under the description. We're trying different fruits also. We did a few, and every once in a while we can do this more. Um, I come up, come down here. Here you can kind of see what we. There's the one of the sour sop. One of my one of my top favorites. I got a lot yeah, of favorite fruits. Yeah, I think fruits. tonight, today, tonight, since it's. Yeah, it is at night now. Ten forty-one and at night, the sour sop has to. That was Be good. It wasn't super sweet, but it was just the right amount of sweetness and this little bit of sour and tartness to it. And this was really good, the mame. But uh, we'll, we'll another day we'll have some more videos. And right. we'll try to get the aki. Yeah, well, maybe seed. tomorrow I'll go ahead and just cook it and we'll eat it and uh, plant the seeds and show you how I just toast it in the toaster oven and it gets all buttery looking. It's a substitute for eggs and like Jamaican dishes and the Caribbean dish. All right, so talk to you soon. Hi. I'm back. I'm gonna take the Aki. Let's go ahead and get these seeds out of here. I'm gonna put the seeds in some water. Look at that. So this is what it looks like when it's been on the tree longer and then it just falls off. Or you could pick it on the tree, but you wanna make sure this has opened. If this has not been open and you have to open it yourself, you could be getting the toxins into the pulp. And I don't know if cooking would get rid of it, but as soon as it's fully ripe, all the toxins are gone into the seed. So let's take these seeds, let's pull it out. Should pull the whole thing out. Just kind of wiggle it. There you go. So this inner part, I'm going to have to try to get out with my finger. Let's go ahead and detach the seed. And the dish tastes so good, but I don't have a lot of them. But I'm going to see if I can find a lot more. I only grabbed this one because it was laying on the ground. I didn't want to pick any from the person's tree. So you can open this up. Pull this, this dry stuff out of here. <laughs> and clean that out. Now this one's maybe a little bit older than others. Most times people would pick it a little bit before while the skin still kind of has some moisture to it. It usually doesn't look like this inside, but let's check the other ones real quick. Right out. Yeah, this one was starting to get close. I'm glad I'm cleaning it right now, but I can still eat this. Yeah, what I'll do is I'll get the spoon, kind of get that out of there, and then we'll put it in the toaster oven. 
and try like 10 minutes or probably less than that because it's when you, you, by touching the fruits real oily like there's a lot of natural oils in there that's good for you that's why when you cook it, it it's kind of like, like like eggs that's buttery like savory just so good and the, oh oh well these I need to wash because they got worms in them oh my god Ew. yeah not to make you sick, not all of these are going to have worms. It's because you probably fell on the ground. <clears throat> so, let me determine I may not cook these. I may have to go find and ask the person if I can pick them from the tree. I'll be right back. Alright, so the third one was bad, so let's take these and I'll clean these seeds, put them in some, some water, and we'll try to grow them out. Alright, say hey to the dogs. Hello. <clears throat> Here's my baby Marjorie. We're just gonna sit this by the, the bread and just slowly toast it for a little bit. Kind of, you want to wait till it's all buttery and kind of the texture will, will be soft and kind of firm. It kind of goes down. Okay, perfect. Ten minutes. All right, we'll be back. Okay, so I did it about. Did 10 minutes and then I did about another about four. You can see how golden it looks. It looks good. It smells like I can't smell right now. I'm kind of stuffy. Look at that. Changes a darker yellow. This brings the oils out. Let's squeeze it so you can see it. See that. Alright, let's try it. So usually you would do a dish with this, but I just wanted to, I've had this before. I like how it tastes. You can taste the oil content. It's almost like it's like butter and it's got a little bit of saltness in it. If I had this in a dish, I could see how it could be like some eggs, pretty close to it. Be like vegan eggs or such. But I like the flavor of it because there's not many fruits that are this much oil, and when you cook it, it just keeps a nice consistency. Hang on, let me reset that again. Uh, I'm real tired. Consistency. I'm gonna edit that out. It has a nice consistency to it. Retake. retake. It has a nice consistency to it, the texture of it. If you were to cook an avocado, I don't know what would happen to it. It'd it dry. Would, it probably would dry out. But this holds its texture together and you cook with it. Do it with uh, onions and all kind of vegetables. Mm -hmm. I'll save these for another day. Just wanted to take care of that. Got the seeds in some some water. I put this in a little bag for them to try. Alrighty.